there. Uh, in criminal law, we'll talk about actus reus mens rea. There's some great resources found on the OGEN site for this, and feel free to use those resources. So the idea is that the Crown has two elements to prove. The act that the accused actually did it, and the mens rea that the accused had the intent or the knowledge or the understanding that they did it, sometimes referred to as the guilty mind. So one funny story I'll tell my students is about the hitman who took his victim up to the top of a to tall apartment building and threw the guy off. And as the guy's falling, ah, somewhere on one of the floors there's a domestic dispute and there's some drunkenness and the person takes a gun and goes to shoot, totally misses their spouse, but the bullet goes out the window and pierces the guy in the heart who's falling, killing him instantly so he's dead before he hits the ground. So in that case, the hitman had the mens rea, but actually didn't have the actus reus, didn't kill him. And the person in the middle of the building uh, had the actus reus, their bullet killed the person, but had no mens rea whatsoever. So in that case, you could say there was no murder, because there, the, neither, neither possible accused had both actus reus and mens rea. And so yeah, it's just a bit of a fun way to look at it, but um, there's all kinds of scenarios and situations that you could put to the student, and that will, uh, and then they can say whether it was actus reus or mens rea. It ties nicely into defenses too, because a lot of defenses are mens rea defenses. They didn't have the proper mental requisite mental uh, element. Um, only alibi I could think of as actus reus. Like I wasn't even there, so I couldn't have done it. So it's an actus reus uh, thing. Then um, another one. Um, so let's say. Uh, a uh, woman decides to kill her husband, goes to buy all the proper things, the, the knife and the gun and the duct tape and uh, the plastic and everything, and, is and knows the husband's coming home uh, at, uh, say, 10 p.m., and she's going to wait in the garage. So she's driving nicely and calmly home to her house, doing the speed limit at 10 p.m. Suddenly, someone runs out in front of her car. Uh, and she has no time to stop, hits the person, kills them instantly. Runs out, looks, it happens to be her husband. Oh, so therefore, no murder because she had no mens rea at that moment. Meaning, she was pr driving property, she, the, this person was poor jaywalking and running out in front of the, of the car. So she can say, oh, it's funny, I was just about to go home and kill him. Um, because at that point where she killed him, there was no mens rea. Um, so you can have some fun and do some scenarios like that. So actus reus and mens rea. Uh, 